Yep. We're back. Yeah, I guess we did draw some attention to ourselves. If we head through UD+, plus, we'll be there in no time flat. So we're off to see the Freedom Fighters. Uh, where are we? What's going on? Email. Come straight home, no detours. Everybody's worried about you. Not even to pee. Dang it. Okay. Akiba dude. Let's get on this. Up the stairs. That. Yeah, UD+. Plus. There she goes. Okay, I guess we'll just follow her. Whoa. Oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> what the heck? Alright. Oh, sorry. Foreign tourists. Let's go to Mogra. Finally! Yeah! Is this Mogra? Oh, it sure is! Oh my god. Oh. oh! Is it really you? Yes, it is. You've been gone for three whole days, man. Where you been? Pops. The hell were you thinking disappearing like that? I thought for sure you'd been kidnapped. Kaito, I can get along with this guy. And what's with the high quality 3D next to you? Something smells really fishy here. High quality 3D. Talking about this is so oh Jesus. I'm not going that far. She saved your life? What do you mean? Um Yeah, it's gonna be a bit tricky. Are we really telling them? You serious? Man, I never would have guessed all those rumors floating around Akiba were actually true. Okay, so we did tell them. Rumors? What, you mean you haven't heard them? There have been like not. a million flips about it. People getting kidnapped, turned into monsters, then terrorizing the locals. Pretty messed up. Yeah, that's... They steal life energy from people. In other words, they drain their vitality, effectively killing all enthusiasm and zeal. And that's... that's... It's pretty low. Not gonna lie. So what you're saying is those recent news reports of people being discovered in deeply lethargic states oh. It's because they've been attacked by these synthesters? Sounds about right, I'm yeah so. Ugh I think I understand I would hope you would This is one of those truth is stranger than fractions things, right? Truth is stranger than fractions? That would be fiction, Cotty. Truth is stranger than fiction That's what I thought So let me get this straight you go off to apply for some shady as hell job where your employer somehow drugs you and turns you into a monster? It's Japan, what do you expect? And nothing leading up to that set off a red flag. You are seriously the world heavyweight champion of dumbass. Hey, at least I'm a champion of something, Toko. Ugh. Come on, Toko, he's been through enough already. Besides, getting lured in by L.E. Swag makes total sense, considering who we're talking about. Um... <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I was a victim of circumstance. I'm a sucker for a pretty figurine. Materialism is an alluring mistress. Ah, I was a victim. How much trouble you've caused everyone? You don't exist in a vacuum, you know. Actually, we technically all do. 
because that's what space is. And the Earth is in space. So we're always in space, technically. So BAM! Flaw in your logic! I yield, I repent my transgressions. Can you see it in your heart, forgive me? Well, that's the way the cookie crumbles. Ah, let's be a bit of a hard ass about it. So, ignoring these two for the moment, <laughs> I believe introductions are in order. Oh, of course. I'm Yuto, Yuto Tachibana. May I have your name as well? You suave little man. Mine is Shizuku. Shizuku Tokikaze. You gave that away pretty good. We call ourselves the Akiba Freedom Fighters. Cause we're total nerds. And we love it. Together we voluntarily patrol the streets of Akihabara, keeping an eye out for trouble. He's one of us as well. And this bar serves as our base of operations. Cause we're that cool. That's right. And I'm one of the central figures in our illustrious group. Name's Kaito Tachibana. And the pleasure's mine. Shut up, Kaito. As you might have figured out, I'm Yuto's older twin brother. Best way to tell us apart? I'm the one with all the ideas. Ah ha 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 That really was... something. Is one of those ideas being out of school and unemployed? Oh, apply cold water to the burn. You shut up! You shut up and you die! Little brothers can't show up, big brothers. It's against the rules. Well, he just did, so he broke the damn rules. Yes, yes, that's enough now. I'm Kati Raikkonen. You're totally foreign. I blew on in from Finland to Japan, so I could see it do its cool busy culture. Oh, God. They're doing this stupid thing. She's Finnish, and she can't... Like, she's saying the word... It would make more sense in Jap in Japanese. You should be pronouncing words wrong. Um, but it when they do it in English, it just kind of falls apart and doesn't really work that well. But we'll just go with it. Finnish maid to she's she's from she blew I blew in she blew in she blew on in who needs to fly on in she blew on in to Japan. Yeah, foreigners. I believe what she's trying to say. Japan. Yeah. Name's Kihachi Sugiyama. I'm the manager of this here game bar, Mogra, where people can knock back a few while they play these old classic arcade cabinets. What a top lad. Can't argue with him. Feel free to just call me Pops. Everybody else around here does. Okay. But you're welcome to call me dear sweet old man if you prefer. She's sucking up. He's got a face fit for the FBI's most wanted list, doesn't he? <laughs> oh! Hey. But he's a good guy. Don't worry. <laughs> I would hope. You could have said that sooner, you know. I'm Toko Sakisaka. I grew up with this dope and just can't seem to get away from him, despite my best efforts. Well, you lose. No need for formalities with me. Everybody just calls me by my first name. Okay. Incidentally, thanks for saving him. Yeah, because I'm safe worthy. I happened upon him during a mission. It was good fortune, nothing more. We are very blank about it. Blank. Blunt. Really? I just did. Th oh, me and words. There is one other member of our group, but she's like a rare monster spawn. She should pop eventually. Guess you'll meet her then. That's, that's my little sister, isn't it? So, what's the plan? Do we all pile into the police station and tell them Akiba's infested with monsters? Nah. Who does that? They'd never believe a word of it. Exactly. Why not? I mean, we can show them living proof. You're one of these synthester things now yourself, right? Then they'll take me into custody and custody custody, and I will be screwed for the rest of my life. So no. Okay, that's true. She's not actually screwing up her, her freaking Japanese. Hmm. So going to the police would involve giving him up as a noble sacrifice. That sounds reasonable. You son of a bitch! Don't even joke about that. Yeah, thank you. Besides, shouldn't we be more concerned with trying to get him back to normal? Yeah, I I, I agree. I mean, if he stays like this. He'll start attacking people sooner or later, right? Uh, oh, well, I hope not. 
That should be no concern. He will not attack others against his will, at the very least. He... He won't? Nah, I'm, I'm the protagonist. Well, what do you think? You're the one in the hot seat here. Um... That! Definitely! Yeah, I guess you did miss three days worth of television. Makes sense you'd want to catch up. Mmm. Of course, it makes all the sense in the world. By which I mean Toko's right. You really are a dumbass. Seriously, you make even me look upstanding. Well, come on then. Jeez! Hmm. There's still an awful lot I don't get, though. Uh, Taiko is an asshole, then I just want to watch my animes. Like, if there's hard evidence of monsters in Akiba, shouldn't the police already be on it? What do you think? But the freaking morons, sir. Until we're certain of that, all we can do is our duty as freedom fighters and investigate. Oh, hey, Tokikaze, would you care to help us out with that? Huh? How not you just call her Shizuku? I suppose you don't really know her yet, so that makes sense. As the Japanese way. Well, I mean, you seem pretty familiar with these things. So come on, what do you say? Yeah, what do you say? It is true that I've been researching them. Yeah, and fighting them. But I'm being specifically targeted by them as well. And I don't wish to involve you all in my affairs. Well, we're kind of already involved. Just saying. <laughs> I think that ship is already sailed. There you go. No kidding. These creeps have already changed one of our guys into some kind of freaky vampire. Mm. So yeah, if you can help with that, we ain't gonna stop you. Haha. <laughs> Alright. Okay then, perfect. Shizuku, please write your name and cell phone number in the group registry. There's a group registry. Yes, cell phone? I'm sorry, I don't have one of those. <gasps> That's rather unusual in this day and age, but if you don't have a cell number, your email address will do just fine. Um. Um. Well. <laughs> hmm. Sounds like you're a tough one to get a hold of. I guess it would be kind of awkward to ask for your home number, huh? Uh. Actually, I haven't been home in quite some time. There were problems. Oh dear. Seriously? So you're an honest to goodness real life runaway, all mired in melodrama? I didn't run away exactly, and I do have a place to stay. You do? A place with plenty of manga. They even have a shower there. Oh, we have hit the jackpot. Don't tell me you're staying in a manga cafe. Do you not have anywhere else to go? Hmm. Hmm. Seems you've got some heavy stuff going on. Pops, you know, the upstairs here is all stark and bare and empty. Okay, I'm trying to work out whether that's a euphemism for anything. No, she's foreign, whatever. Hmm? Oh yeah, you're right. I think we got some bedding squirreled away around here too. Who the hell now, day and age, says squirreled? Whatever. What do you say, Shizuku? If you like, you're free to stay on the second floor here for a spell. Do it! And we won't take no for an answer. Meeting you like this feels like it's gotta be more than a coincidence. Know what I mean? Yeah. Having you around can only be to our benefit if we're to continue studying these monsters. Sure, let's go with that. It would seem to be a win for all parties. <laughs> hey, win, all right. Then we all agree. The Akiba Freedom Fighters have a new member. Three cheers, Bob Bob. Oh God. But wait. Ah, oh, yes, you have. Yeah, do it. All right. Just for a little while. Though. Yes. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Okay, so here we freedom fighters stand in the midst of a maelstrom. Maelstrom. Love that word. You said you fought some of these things already. Aside from that, have you ever done any real hand-to-hand -hand combat? Um... In the virtual world... I was watching the fires of Toko's Wrath. I can hold my own in fighting games while I can argue with the best of them. 
Okay, I can't argue well. I'm shit at fighting game, so let's go with that one. I never meant to forge anything. You just mean we fight so often you happen to get something out of it, right? Ulterior motives. I'm not sure I'd even call those fights. They seem to be more like tests of endurance to me. Oh, that is hmm. Yep. Okay. Huh? What was that? Uh N nothing. Nothing at all. Jeez. Let, let's a bit cluey. See, I'm getting a little worried now. Hey, I know. A friend of mine runs a coliseum in Akiba. Or a battle arena, I guess. Whatever you want to call it. Of course your friend does. You know, we're going to somehow be connected to t and, and tied to people who own everything in Akihabara, aren't we? This might be a good place to get yourself caught up on the basics of combat. You want, I'll introduce you. Yeah, probably wouldn't hurt. For real? What kind of person is this? Who the hell runs a battle arena in Akiba? Agreed. Just a martial arts nut I know who found herself managing the place, that's all. Okay. But she doesn't let just anyone step into the ring. You gotta pass some kind of test first or something. Well, of course there's a test. Why wouldn't there be? Let her know what's up. So you better get going. Muzu. You could at least say my name, you bastard. Oh, and take Shizuku with you too. A little extra training can't hurt any, right? Yeah, sure, I'll take it. <laughs> Come with me. I think Toko should go with. She can probably force your way in there, no problem. Test be damned. Watch your tongue. I am a dainty and respectable lady. You got that? Seriously, rude much? Oh, oh, oh. it's not a bad idea though. So who will you escort to the arena? Shizuku or Toko? Oh, now I gotta make a choice. Shizuku, Toko, Katie. Oh, the maid's not gonna be much help. Um. It made more sense. All right. Yeah. If I'm going to eliminate them, the synthesters, then I'll have to be as strong as I can. Yeah. The battle arena is on the other side of Main Street and right past Jump Street. You got that? I'm surprised you were able to form a formidable sentence. You got that? Let's go. Knock him dead. Thank you. Yeah, through Junk Street. Oh, changing partners. You change partners by talking to the person you wish to accompany in Mogra. Oh, always be sure to select the most suitable person to, uh, to your desired ending as your choices will contribute greatly to the story's conclusion. Multiple endings confirmed. Okay. Ah, do you have a moment? What's going on? I was wondering if there's anyone you have your eye on. I'm fairly perceptive in matters of the heart, so I can tell you what the many girls in your life think of you. Here we go. Here we go. Please feel free to ask me for an update anytime. Oh, wow. May affect. Okay, so if we're a prick, that's actually going to affect things. Okay. Which in turn may affect the story's outcome, so be sure to check back with me from time to time and always think before you speak. So we gotta be sure about what to. Wow, that music just got really loud. We need to make sure about the decisions that we're making then. Alright, um. Well, I actually think that's gonna do it for now. So I wanna thank you guys for watching. Uh, we, in, in the next episode, we should be heading to the battle arena to, uh, toughen up a bit, get a bit of the basic combat, a bit more of the basic combat down, but, uh, at least now we've been introduced to, well, to our group and I'm guessing a majority of the, the antagonists. Let's go see what's on TV. Looks interesting. I'd probably watch that. Alright, well thanks guys, I will see you next time, thanks for sticking around, and uh, as always, take care, I've been Darkest, catch you later. What do you think? Oh! They got their shit kicked in, that's what happened.
Oh. Oh, there's my fucking gussie. Yeah, he's good. 